That's loud. Hey, hey, it's me, Hard Duck Man. Today we're gonna be playing a co uh, Today we're gonna be playing a short horror game called Cold Shot, where we, us, me, we take on the role of a hitman on a seemingly normal job that apparently goes very, very wrong. How so does it go wrong? I don't know. <laughs> But that's what we're gonna find out, and hopefully we can murk this dude, make some moolah, get out. Okay, let's get into this. Boy. Number one hitman right here. Bullets. Kill. I'm cold-blooded. A very cold night. Oh, I can't- I can hardly see the text. Oof, hold on. A very cold night. Now I can read it. I would like to be at home watching TV and relaxing. But. I have a job. Yes. That's the life of the hitman, baby. Gotta make that money. Spencer York. He lives in 12. I cannot read that properly. Something straight. Everything is ready. I cannot fail. Well, as a fit man, as a hitman, yeah, you can. <laughs> oh, I'm back from work. Oh, did you kill the person? No. You don't say that. What? You don't say that? Ooh, okay. Ooh. Very pretty style. I, 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 I really like it. We got the gun ready, baby. <sighs> okay. Spencer man? Is it supposed to be that bright? I just missed a bunch of shots. Oh my god, no. I think the brightness is a little bit too high. Okay, there we go. That's a little bit more tolerable. Now I can actually see what I'm looking at. Is that him? Did I hit him? I don't know. I, I'm pretty sure I shot him in the head. I'm gonna make sure. Yeah, as a fucking hitman, better make sure, man. We did a clean shot. I did miss about, like, ten fucking bullets. So I'm surprised I didn't hear those. But we did the job nonetheless. Now we're just gonna hope nobody else knew that. Knew that we killed them. Only got a few bullets. Alright. Let's do this. Anybody here? No. E. Chains look rusty. Do I shoot them? Oh my god, I just No, I think I was supposed to do that. Okay. What's up, bro? Is anybody else home in the building? No. I don't think so. You live alone, right, friend? That just looks moderately clean. No sign of anybody staying over. Good. Job done. That's it. <laughs> we did it. Ooh, my man works out. Oh, maybe he's buff. Maybe, maybe he's got a really strong brain. Maybe he can serve. Why are doors opening? That's concerning. Oh. Very concerning. Hello? Oh, does he have a kid? Oh. I'm sorry. I'm also very scared. I know I'm a hitman. Is, is this a person? Something is under the flesh. What is under the flesh? Can I, can I get it? Do I have to waste a bullet? I don't think I should. I'm gonna wait to waste the bullet on that. Oh? I heard somebody squeak open the door. Why is the dresser moved like that? Huh? What's going on in this house? We're just just a hitman type of guy, huh? What's going on in here? It's on the table, huh? 25th March 2014. 
She's a little bit weird writing this. I've never written a diary until today. What is that sound? Is that a rat? Shh, I'm trying to read. Rat. I guess the more I do, the more I will be used to. Marvin, the therapist told me that this can help with the process. I try to keep my mind focused on anything. For stupid it is, at the end of the day, I cannot stop thinking about Mina. I feel so miserable. 26 March, 2014. Second day in a row. Tonight, I didn't sleep. The pills are useless. I stayed watching these weird early morning TV programs. Couldn't stop thinking about her. His wife, oh, his wife passed away, I'm guessing. I spent the morning shopping in the town. For a moment, I thought Mina was on the other sidewalk. Probably I'm starting to lose my mind. The afternoon has been pretty normal. I decided to go for a walk. 28th March, 2014. Third day. And guess what? Another night without sleeping. I'm beginning to worry. Maybe I should call Marvin. What is that sound? Should I be fucking worried, man? I'm starting to get worried. But I need to read this. Maybe I should call Marvin. Okay, I have an appointment with Marvin for tomorrow. Must be serious if they scheduled me so soon. The rest of the day has been pretty normal. Can't stop thinking about Mina. I'm almost used to it. I don't know if it's because I'm mentally devastated or because I'm beginning to overcome it. I know, that was... There's something going on. Fourth day, Marvin is a fucking asshole. I didn't like how it went the whole thing. What kind of fucking therapy is this? I'm not going back. Fuck you, Marvin. Fuck you and your fucking diary. This, that, that, that sound is freaking me the fuck out. A week without touching this goddamn diary. Marvin keeps calling me. I don't give a fuck. His pills are definitely bullshit. The alcohol does a better job. Can't stop thinking about Mina. I'm so miserable. This is more than a week later. I don't know why I keep writing this. Maybe it's now my personal ritual when I'm unable to sleep. Today I decided to join a support group at the church. It's full of parents in the same situation as me. I'm feeling much better now. Not that good in weeks. Tonight I went hiking with some of the support group. Went to an abandoned shrine for some reason. I can't remember what we did there. They seem very interested in me. I think I will invite them at home. This is three days later. Hey Janessa told us that soon we'll bring them back. Dead people. You're doing necromancy. Don't... F Do not fuck with necromancy. It's, it's not gonna end well. They're either gonna be a zombie, gross, or they're not gonna be the same. Just don't fuck with it. The deformed pig just appeared in my yard. I can't believe it worked. This means everything is ready, and more important, they were right. I'm going to call them. I think I can hear Mina playing with the other kids. I mean, you hear it. What? The w is she a ghost outside? Is she a zombie? Are you not allowed to look at her? That is... Is there a dead wife walking around? Today is the big day. Everything is ready. Soon the group will come home. Janessa has to tell me something very important. I'm a little worried. Oh, okay. The, the, the death ritual doesn't matter, okay? It's some freaky shit. For sure. But that's not why we're here. What's up, dog? Nothing going on in here. Hey, what's up? What's up, my friend? Oh, he's he's up. Okay. He's not here. Mina. Oh, he's not here. He's behind us, isn't he? He's behind us. Maybe if we keep reading, we'll be fine. I mean, if you're reading this, it means everything went right. I'm... Scared. A few hours ago... I didn't know I would die so soon. However, thinking about the reason makes my first moments happier than ever. I'm very nervous, but my life without you means nothing. Doing this is the best decision I will ever make. Don't be sad. Daddy loves you. I'm with you forever. Seem pointing at me. You. He saw me. The dude saw me when I was shooting at him. Yeah, so those missed bullets did fuck up. Okay. I'm sorry. That's beside our issue. There is a crying alive man. Oh no. I don't like this. I don't like it either. I'm getting out of here. Yes, I am. Yes, I am. 
Oh, my lord, how are you doing, sir? I shot you with all my bullets. Better keep moving. Oh, yeah. Let's get the fuck out of here. How did he board this shit up so quick? How did he board it up so quick? Huh? How did I... Oh, my God, I'm stuck. Okay, he locked me in. This dude is fucking quick. How? Ah! Motherfucker, you fucking bitch! Who? Oh. Hey, man. Hey, hey, bro. Chill with your fucking ham ham. Okay. All right, you just beat me to death. You just... Ow! Ow! Fuck you! Fuck you! Oh, my God. Oh, my God. We try? What? How do I... Okay. Was I not supposed to use my bullets? It's locked. What's going on in here? I can't see anything. The... I got more bullets. Oh. Why does this guy just have... Pistol rounds. For the exact gun I'm using. How convenient. That that would happen. Okay, we're gonna go say hi to our friend again. Oh, a hot tub. Even more bullets. Doctor. Marvin. There's more notes. Martin Lewis. Patient Spencer York. Age 46. Weight, height. I don't know what that is. In feet. Weight, 90 kilograms. Diagnosed. The patient suffers a major depressive disorder induced by schizophrenia. Constant recalls the loss of a child that never existed. Oh, fuck. Oh, that is... That really sucks. That really fucking sucks. I almost feel bad for him now. Even though he did just beat my head in moments ago. Like, I'm sorry, dude. Okay. I don't like this. I'm getting out of here. It's locked. Yeah, I'm just gonna... I'm gonna look for anything to get out. I don't know how to get out of here. What do, what do I do? I uh, do... I shoot... Shoot him. Oh, you scared me, man. You scared me there, friend. Get, just, just die. Just die. Okay, better keep moving. Okay, yeah. How are we gonna get out of here, though? That's the real question. Came from the bathroom. I don't think the sound came from the bathroom either. Oh, you're up again? Bro, how strong are you? You're not a normal man. You're not, you don't have schizophrenia. You got fucking invincibility out of you. Fucking something, something. Something like that. Okay. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Fuck you, man. Okay, I'm absolutely strapped. I don't think that sound came from the bathroom. What's in here? Nothing. Um, the windows are boarded up. I've got nothing to get the fuck out of here with. Oh, hey, dude. Hey, fuck you! Just get... I'm out of bullets! I'm... Okay. Alright, you're just gonna beat me to death. You're just gonna smack my ass with that hammer. That... You just... Okay. Something is under the flesh. Yeah, is there? Is under the flesh? Oh! I need a sharp object. Is there a knife? By chance. Can I get a weapon? Can I shoot the window to get glass? On second thought, of, of course not. Of course I can't do that. What did I just get? Oh, ammo. Oh. Oh, yes. More ammo. Oh, yes. Uh-huh, uh-huh. You love to see it. Anything? Something that's gonna assist me in my fight against this very strange old man. So, what are our options? Is a new door gonna be open? It's locked. Yeah. It is. I don't really know what to do. I honestly don't. Better keep moving. I don't think that sound came from the bathroom. 
you got the knife. Oh, cool. Oh, hey, bro. I, I, I found the knife. Bop, 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 bop. Oh, hey. Oh, my God, you run fast. You run fast. Why are you... My man, you're bleeding out like fucking crazy. Do I need to complete your pagan blood ritual? The library key. Wow. Ah! I did the ritual! Your non-existent daughter is back! <laughs> oh my god. Don't think he's around at the moment. It worked? That's great! Come in this door. I'm waiting for you. Oh, God. <laughs> uh. Buddy, you're freaking me the fuck out. If I walk, are you gonna hear me? Yeah, you, I think you do. If you walk in here, you're getting shot. Found some pages that belong to this book. It's barely readable. Local folklore. Rashmon symbolizes... What? Symbolizes flesh. Appearance resembles a pig. Rajmont can provide an earthly desire. <laughs> earthly desire if the steps are followed correctly. Can provide an what? The initial phase involves performing the valley rituals. Don't come to that door. Okay. Continue reading. Once the rituals are done, Ra Rajkmon will choose his host. Of course he would. He likes choosing people. Well, host is chosen, Rajkmon will materialize itself in the host home? Oh. So there's like some kind of literal fucking demon in this place. Okay. Is that what I saw in the kitchen? I only saw it for like a fucking frame. In the second in this oh in the second phase, the host must sacrifice the material form and share its flesh among the participants. Only the host can cut the body. The last f f phase involves redemption of the host for killing Rashmon. A being of a lower plane must kill the host after the host's sacrifice. The desire of Wait. So do- If I kill this dude, is he gonna get what he wants? I'm confused. E. E, okay. E, E. Just click, just click them. Is this just a puzzle game? Am I playing a fucking puzzle game right now? Oh. I mean, uh, I, I don't know if there's any specific way to do that, but I did it. You got the basement key. Okay. I'm going to the basement. That sounds like a fucking terrific idea. Like nothing bad is going to happen in this creepy ass house's basement. Where fucking pagan death rituals are going on and uh, non-existing children are coming back to life. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna go down there. Ah. Uh, or, hear me out, we could shoot this guy with the 22 rounds of ammunition we have, yank his hammer, pry the boards off, if he gets back up, shoot a few more rounds, and skedaddle. Alright, how about we do that? Where he at? Where he at? Where he at? Bro? Where you at, dog? It worked! Ah! <laughs> oh! Oh! Is that Spoon? Did you just kill yourself with a fucking spoon? Okay. Ah, what the fuck is that? Why is he babies? Why is the baby? Why is the babies everywhere? What is going on? Why is there fucking molten lump babies? Why is there lump babies? Kill the unborn children. In the name of Jesus Christ. Oh, I'm so fucked. I'm so fucked. I'm so... F 
Undoubtedly fucked. It's not even funny. I'm gonna juke the fuck out of you, babies. You ever seen a fucking juke this good? There's more babies! Why is there so many babies? What are you doing, babies? Why do you look like that? Okay? You're just gonna slap your little baby meat tentacles at me. Alright. Yeah, I, I get it. Cool. Fuck you. That's what the baby sound is. It's those little fucks down in the basement. Oh my god. Oh, we know where all the ammo is. Probably more secret ammo here somewhere. I need to stay strapped. Oh, do we need to save all our ammo to kill the guys downstairs? That makes sense. Okay, okay. Oh, hey, buddy. Hey, pal. You're not doing the best, aren't you? Is he gonna follow us? Get out of here. Just, just get, get the fuck out of here, okay? Okay. Let me grab the knife. Let me grab the knife. Let me grab the knife. You greedy dirtbag! You wanna see me do a plague and blood, blood ritual? You can't do it. Oh. Damn, son. I did it. Okay, I figured out the puzzle and how it works. So the basement is just full of fucking children. Huh? And you're telling me we're supposed to go down there? Yeah? And... And do what? I locked it. <laughs> now what do I do? There's just gonna be a bunch of little babies. Hey, babies. I'm a hitman, you know? You know how many babies I can kill? Uh, you know, I'm a professional baby killer. That's fucked up. One's well, got a few missions to kill babies. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. I wasn't a hitman then. I was just, uh, worked in an abortion clinic. Oh, God! Oh, my God. There's so many wet little sloppy babies. Okay. I, I lured them out. That's better than nothing, eh? I think so. What's going on in the baby room? What's going on in the baby room, huh? I'm in the sewers! Apparently! Apparently there's a sewer system! I'm gonna die in this shithole! No, I'm not! Fuck the fall! Oh my god, there's so many babies! Oh my god! Why is there so many? Why is there so many babies? But I can't leave my stuff. No, I can't. I gotta get my sniper rifle. That's just expensive. The, I did my job. The guy's dead. What can I say? What can I say? Okay, grab the sniper. Cool. Where's the car? The car is nearby. Okay. Oh my god, this is fucking crazy. I need to wait until all the babies get up here and I'm gonna run around them. This is what I call the hard duck man baby juke. Only the pro baby dodgers know this. Oh my god, why is there so many? How is there so many? Why am I questioning pagan death rituals? Oh my god. Holy shit. Ah! Stop hitting me, babies! Get out of here, babies! Fuck you, I'm getting out of here, yo! Get in the truck! That's my truck, isn't it? I think it's my truck! Get I can't leave! The sniper and the backpack- The backpack?! I forgot the backpack?! Are you fucking kidding me?! Oh my god. Yeah, I've got my mixtape. You know how good that shit is? It's in my backpack. Quite literally more valuable than my life. It's the, the baby. The baby playlist. 
Where, where is the bag? Where is my bag? Oh my god! Where did I put it? Oh, oh my god! Backpack! It's here! It, it's, there it is! Woo! Holy shit! I got more bullets! Fuck you, motherfuckers! Woo! I'm going home, bitch! And you're going to hell! Keep some bullets in the chamber, just in case we run into some problems in the truck. Go quickly, go quickly, go quickly, because these babies are right behind us, and let me tell you, they are not looking happy. Get in the truck, get in the truck, get in the truck, get in the truck. Woo! Start that bad boy up! Drive! Woo! Get me the fuck out of here! Hallelujah, baby! Woo! I'm so tired, I don't even know where I'm headed to. This job has been a complete mess. Yeah, I'd fucking say so. Let's make all them alive. But yeah. Still question burns my mind. Did they deserve it? Didn't matter before, why should it matter now? Zero. Just wanna start from scratch. Begin a new life. Yeah, after seeing that many dead babies, I would too. I don't deserve it. That's fair. That's fair, my man. You've done some bad things. Doesn't mean you can't become a better person, though. Hey? That's just, hey. We're just driving to the distance. Hey, okay. That was, that was good, I like that. Uh, the old man running around uh, wasn't as scary as I thought it was gonna be. The babies definitely got me though. It scared the fucking shit out of me. But that was fun, I really liked that. Good, enjoyable, quick little experience. So, yeah, that's all I have to say about it. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, like, comment, subscribe, turn on post notifications if you're very cool. And other than that, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace, peace.